What's going on everybody? It is Saturday, November 29th. My name is Andy Frisch. You are watching FreshEvolutionFitness.com video every day, number 48. I'm feeling kind of official today because my second tripod came in the mail and uh, it's, a, it's a thing. Of, I wish you could see this. It's a thing of beauty and I can get that stinking glare from the light out of my board now. Look at it. It's so pretty. So uh, it's a Saturday. That means we're doing supplement Saturday and I'm going to be doing a review of Shatter excuse me, hashtag shatter. You know it's like hip and trendy now because it's a hashtag shatter for whatever reason. So it's a pre-workout powder and with my supplement reviews, instead of me just kind of droning on and on about what it has in there, um, I want to give you my honest opinion and honest feedback. And obviously only things I've tried. So I'm gonna be your guinea pig for a lot of this stuff. But one problem I have with the supplement industry is obviously it's unregulated and there's a lot of hype. So something like Shatter, excuse me, hashtag Shatter SX7. And uh, I think it's SX7 because it's super extreme and it has seven ingredients. But something like this, you notice right off the bat, right, that it's it's shiny, right? It's like you found the Ark of the Covenant or something. It's, oh, but so this is going to sit on the shelf and just like scream, buy me. Uh, and there's a lot of stuff on the on the front right now. 147% increase in muscle strength. Subjects gained 8.8 .8 pounds of lean mass in 12 weeks gains. So things that you have to realize are a lot of times these studies are paid for by the companies that produce this stuff and the the individuals in the sub in the see that the subjects in the studies, let me get that sentence right, are not always um prime candidates for the subjects or for the studies. I'll just put it that way. So you can't always trust what the stuff says, obviously. Um, now, with something like Shatter, like I said, it's got seven ingredients. I'm sorry, I keep looking up here too. My camera used to be down here and now it's up there because my tripod, so bear with me if I keep looking down here. But um, the, the main ingredients on here that I like, it's got beta alanine, which is an amino acid and it helps kind of with endurance. So um, people that are running, things like that can take it. Or if you're lifting, if you want to kind of keep your energy levels high, your endurance levels high throughout the session, it'll help. It will make you kind of itchy. It can make you turn kind of red like a niacin flush almost. So bear that in mind. If you take this and you start itching, it's not an allergic reaction. It's just the beta alanine. Uh, and it goes without saying, guys, any of these pre-workouts and fat burners and stuff that I do reviews for, all have big fancy warnings on the back that you should be reading and paying attention to obviously hopefully you know that but uh so it's got beta alanine it's also got uh adenosine 5 triphosphate disodium which is basically i don't know if it is directly atp or if it converts to atp but adenosine triphosphate is something that your body uses i talked about this briefly in some of the other videos it's something your body uses for energy with extremely heavy lifts within like the first, I think, uh, 20 seconds or 15 seconds of a session. So, and it doesn't have to be an extremely heavy lift. It's just your body has three different energy systems and ATP is one of them. So, um, so long story short, beta alanine and ATP will give your body energy and help you get out more sets, more reps, a longer workout and, and higher energy levels throughout it. Um, of course, pretty much any pre-workout is gonna have caffeine. This has caffeine. Uh, it looks like one scoop has about 160 milligrams, so a little bit more than a cup of coffee, I think. Then it's got Myristica fragrance extract, brown algae extract, holy basil extract, and grains of paradise. I told you it was the Ark of the Covenant. So all that stuff, honestly, no clue. I'm not going to lie to you. And these videos are only five minutes, so even if I did know, it would probably take too long. But, uh, I mean... The only thing on here, it tells you on the back what everything is for, but like grains of paradise, all it says is contains the pungent compound 6-paradol. So obviously everybody knows what 6-paradol is, right? I mean, who wouldn't know what that means? So, and it's pungent, that just means it, it smells bad, I think. So anyways, hashtag shatter, guys. It is a good pre-workout. It gives you energy. It gets you hyped. It doesn't taste that great, uh, but... It does the job when it comes to working out, so it gives you that long-lasting energy. I definitely do notice kind of an extended amount of endurance, more energy for the, throughout the sets. So give it a try. Just read the warning label and go easy on the serving size. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.